giving decent examples really does tend to be one of the more underutilized methods when working with an AI, yet yields probably the most significant results. In this video, I'll show you a bunch of the best ways to get the AI to adopt your exact style or a style you like when it replies, and explain why this has such a large impact. This video follows on in my latest series on prompt engineering and works well alongside the tips in those, so be sure to check them out after this one. In a previous video, I explained how powerful it is to tell the AI to act as a certain person or role. This focused on giving the AI context to be aware of when it replies, but this video is if you want to go even further and have some existing material to back it up. Equipped with some written content that you like or that you've produced, you can tell the AI to copy the content style exactly or to use a piece of content as a foundation for its style. I like to add this to the very end of my prompt. The AI is given context of the request first and then a separate clear example at the end in quotes. The separation keeps the prompt nice and clean for us and helps reduce any confusion for the AI while it replies. The examples themselves can be a direct copy and paste of an entire piece or just extracts of work you have to hand. Any written content, formatted work, correspondence or code will do. And you can give it anything as well. It can be an entire full-length essay or a single paragraph that you like the style of. It could be a chain of emails or a single text message you've sent to a mate. Literally anything you'd like to see the AI replicate. Let's look at this example. Say we want the AI to write exactly like us. First, we followed the advice given in this series and we told the AI all about us. We've then also told it what we want it to write and as such, it's produced a decent bit of work. But what if our writing's unique? We use sentence structure, tense and language that the AI just hasn't got right. For that, we can give the AI a piece of our own content, something we've written before. The more related to the current topic, the better. With this, the AI will examine the work, looking at the language, grammar, sentence length, the way we pose questions, and much more. It will then take this knowledge of our style and adapt its own output to match, ultimately giving us an incredibly unique piece of work that appears to be written by us. You can actually take this further too. We can make the AI truly write like a clone of ourselves by separately getting the AI to analyze a piece of our work and output all the descriptive keywords that would allow an AI to fully understand our writing style. This prompt will get the AI to list descriptive keywords for a bunch of writing style categories. Writing tone, sentence structure, vocabulary choice, grammar, and unique language used. I won't go into it too much as I made an entire video all about this and how to use it to get around detectors, but I do use this process a lot. I have a big list of my own keywords that match my style perfectly and I paste them in all the time. I'll leave the prompt for analysing your own writing style in the description below. But say you don't want the AI to write like you, say you want it to write more academically or more dramatically, you can simply use decent examples that you have to hand or some work that you really like that you found online. If you love the style of it, just paste it in. If you want work that utilises tables, lists, code samples and more, make sure the examples have those too. If you only have a little bit of content, like a single sentence or a paragraph, that's okay as well. It's still giving the AI a massive amount of insight into what you're after and can definitely get it to better align its style. If you want the AI to write consistently across many articles, that's made easier with examples too. I suggest finding a central piece of work that incorporates all the bits that you like most and just keeping it to one side. A sort of master document of content and formatting you like. Then just copy and paste this in whenever you need a new but matching piece of work. It's a great way to make articles appear to be coming from a single author. It doesn't just have to be extracts of work though. Ultimately, we're just trying to give the AI context around the exact way to apply language. This means if you want to write in a famous author's style, you can just drop in their name and if the AI knows what their style is, it will attempt to adopt this too. All in all, a great way to think about why this is also useful is it can be a massive time saver. No need to go back and forth with AI trying to adapt what's been written, and no need to spend ages outlining a bunch of conditions ahead of time. Simply tell the AI to write something, and then tell it to copy the example style. The results can be huge, with little to no extra work on our end. If you want to see more videos in this series, be sure to sub to the channel. Thanks so much for watching, and I'll catch you in the next one soon.